Nuestra cita de hoy es en Napa, que además de buen vino, tiene una de las principales colecciones de arte producido por artistas del área de la Bahía de San Francisco. asking you uh, the curatorial framework what link it has with the title of the exhibition well the inspiration for the exhibition was a work by an artist named William T Wiley who's the foremost collected artist in the Derosa collection and it's on view in the gallery in the the plexi vitrine and the title of that work is called Beatnik Meteor so um, conceptually, well formally, the piece is a, a box. It's kind of like a time capsule that contains a lot of different elements of Wiley's own collaborations with other artists, his relationships with other um, people within the arts community, uh, kind of from the 50s to the 70s, the pieces from the 1970s. And so I had been thinking about a way to um, sort of cement the exhibition in collaborative work that were artists who are creating generative platforms for other artists to create manifest work. Um, so I really liked the idea of linking emerging artists to the history of this place um, and really try to encapsulate the spirit of De Rosa. So the five artists she chose for this exhibition have each invited collaborators to work with them and we have 20 performers here tonight and it really is, you know, like the stone dropped in the water, the ripples and the resonances, the public programs that will take place around the Bay Area will all come from this vision. Connected with the vision of the Rosa Collection mm -hmm. and with this uh, philosophy of taking risk mm -hmm. and the space for collaboration with artists, like, tell us a little more about the link with the, co the collection with the mm -hmm. exhibition. Yes. Um, our founder, Rene De Rosa, was known for starting to collect artists before they were well known back in the 50s. And he created the Public Museum in the year 2000 with the vision that it would first support artists and provide for the support of artists and the vitality of our region. So our mission as a public museum is to provoke the imagination and the artistic spirit of our time through celebrating the art and artists of Northern California. came together through William Wiley's box, which was about um, which was about collaboration. It was many artists inside this one um, suitcase, essentially a briefcase. And um, so the idea of working together came from that. None of us had ever collaborated before. Yeah, this is our first time working together in the studio, all touching and making every sculpture together. So every object in the show is completely collaborative. Every color, every material were all built together. And what do you think? Was it a democratic process or that there were fights in the middle? <laughs> it's hard, it's hard. It's hard. It's it is. <laughs> Me, probably. <laughs> <laughs> the crazy. Um. <laughs> 
it, yeah. was, it was very democratic. All of us, all of us participated in every single sculpture. There was no like this is my thing and you can yeah. paint it or something. Or you ruin it. No, <laughs> no. I and mean, there are snags. Yeah, it was mostly beautiful because we are very connected and we really wanted to work together. So it was a beautiful collaboration. But there's yeah. always moments yeah. where both or three or two or one it's different times and yeah there could be a little so tension then, I can't yeah. imagine it's good but that's, yeah. that's, good. The, that's the most it's exciting it's good that we're three <laughs> yeah. the, the most exciting is when you think you have something strong and then someone arrives the third one is like no what about that and you're like oh my okay. god yes, yeah okay. <laughs> Thank you.